Welcome back, everyone. I hope everybody has enjoyed their long weekend and at least woke up today ready to start a new week. We have just left the, uh, the cradle. And today we begin exploring the embrace and meeting one of my favorite side characters in the whole game because he's just so damn weird. And here we are. I'm actually not used to starting this journey in the middle of the night. I wonder how I managed to swing that. All of it in the embrace. The world just got bigger. But also more dangerous. Now there are two ways we can go about this. First of all, there is a uh, there's a corrupted zone over here. We're gonna run over and take care of that and also shoot a lot of things along the way. It's going to be fun. Maybe not for them. Because I haven't been back here since... Well, been back to this game in particular since uh, last Wednesday. This is a good warm-up for me anyway, because I have to relearn all the controls again. Well, that just makes that watcher very unobservant. Kind of wonder if the reason why they can detect that something has happened is because they see those same little indicators that I see. Damn. Didn't even notice. Can't have you given away that. was very well timed. I am pleased. Really? Ah, oh, well. And bunny, okay. If I remember correctly, there is a lookout point up nya somewhere. We'll take care of that after we deal with the si with the. I almost called them saber cats. That's not what they are. They're <laughs> 
That tells you what I've been playing lately. My difficulty settings get changed? Checking that real quick, sorry. No, I'm on story mode, I guess. When it's not a sneak attack, it does less damage. I'm also not using my sharp shot bow, I forgot about that. Never know when I might need these. Okay, so what do we got around here? Boars and a purple thing. And yes. can cut like claws. The way they have this laid out for, like, hiding places in battle makes me think that they envisioned a completely different way of taking down those scrappers. And while I don't agree with them, it is interesting. Finally. Hmm. Okay, turkey, turkey, boar. Got everything? Looks like it. Now to find my way up there somehow. Well, I'll say this for a night run, it makes those lookout points a lot more visible. I can look into the past. Wow, what are you focus. doing? Wrong button. just doesn't sound like he's having a good week ever when we run into him rabbit let's go into these I've been saving them, but they do so much more damage. And since I started this playthrough, I actually really don't feel like I've fully mastered it anymore, so...
This is not what I wanted. There we go. Is that everybody? Are we good? Oh, the sun's coming out. That's another thing I was hoping for. It wants me to do the hunting trials. And I know those are a major thing. And they'll be infinitely easier for me to do at this level than any other. But probably not going to be my primary concern until I run into Nils. And I say that like I'm not going to ignore him, so I can show you what he does when you do ignore him. Where are you at? Okay. Get on with it. This area looks completely different in the daylight, doesn't it? This is where we got our first sawtooth. Well, up there is where Just we got our first sawtooth. Just away for now. where the ancient armory cave is, but we're not going to jump into that too soon. It's not like we can get anything there right now anyway. A hunting ground. We're also there's good machine hunting across the river. <laughs> okay, we are not going to Mother's Crown, so I'm going to change that on the quests real quick. next to it. Now see, here is Nils. He's a wonderful guy. I'm gonna take all his shit and I'm going to ignore him though. Now, just for references sake, he's over here by this merchant dude in the campfire. My I pause it picking up some kind of signal. That if I ignore him, Maybe he's gonna pop that. up later on the road. He has done this before. He just really wants you to notice he's good at killing stuff. We also want to head in the direction of this one because there's another settlement that comes out as a result. Do 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 don't notice me. That was loud. It's fine, we're cool. Anora village, up on the heights. 
Yep. Gonna go hit that, because why not? It's also a lot of fun side quests, so... I'm not saying we're doing 100% completion on this one, but I do like to do all the side quests at the very least. It's free XP and you're headed that way anyway. That brave. It sounds like he's suffering. Yes. It's only a matter of time before he passes on. I've seen people die before, but never in such pain. I want to be strong like you, but... Nothing I do comforts him. I don't even have any dream willow to ease his pain. There should be some in stashes along grave trails to the east, but... I must keep vigil for this man. I don't suppose you could check the stashes? Even a little dream willow would ease his pain. You said that you, um, wanted to be strong, like me. I take it you know who I am? I do. I know a lot of people didn't want you in the Proving. But if you hadn't been there, everyone would have died. Shows how much we know. The very person we needed was someone the tribe never wanted. I wish I could borrow some of your courage now him. You don't need to borrow what you already have. I hope you're right. How did the man you're caring for get hurt? He was one of the war party. Wounded in battle down the ridge there. He was too weak to be carried back to Mother's heart. So they brought him here. I'm supposed to comfort him, but all I can do is whisper. Tell him to think of his mother's smile. Could you see the ambush from here? I heard it. Explosions and screams and... and howls of machines like monsters. That's what he keeps groaning and muttering about. Machines like nightmares ripping everyone to shreds. If only I could calm him. Help him forget all that and go to All Mother in peace. Tell me what you need again. Dream Willow. An oil made from the bark of water willows. That brings sleep and numbs pain. My supply is gone, but hunters keep it in stashes along grave trails, out of reach of beasts and machines. There should be some left in the stashes along trails to the east. You're young for a healer, aren't you? Yes. I'm still learning the basics. But all the true healers are busy in Mother's heart. Besides, this brave is beyond healing. What he needs is someone to stay with him. And that, I can do. I'll check the stashes for Dream Willow if I get a chance. You will? Thank you. My only wish is to ease this poor man's suffering. That's all well and good, but in the process, we're gonna meet a dick. But first, this guy. You're Aloy, aren't you? They say you've been made a seeker with rite of passage from the Sacred Land. Yes. To track the killers who attacked the Proving. I can't imagine leaving all Mother's protection. But my sister, Nicola, is like you. Fearless. She went north to find a Karja officer called Zaid, one of the captains of the Red Raids. He's dangerous. I'm really worried about her. Why is it that, like, guys named Zaid are never good news? Did the Matriarchs really give Nikoa permission to leave? No. They refused her. But nothing could stop her from going after Zaid. He... He murdered our father doing the Red Raids. Nikoa saw it happen. Hid in the cellar and forced herself to watch. 
You changed her. I lived in the Embrace during the Red Raids. What was it like out here? <laughs> For ten years, the Karja attacked without warning. Devils like Zaid butchered braves and kidnapped civilians for blood sacrifice. It all ended when the mad Sun King died. The matriarchs say his son wants to set things right. But that wasn't enough for Nicole. In fairness, she has a point, which you'll discover later. You could have gone with her. Leave the sacred land and be purged from all mother's eternal memory? No. I begged Nicole to stay so she could avoid that fate. She said she didn't care. I don't know. Will she really be cursed for avenging our father? It seems... cruel. I'll keep an eye out for her. Oh, Mother, bless you. I know the matriarchs won't let her return to the sacred land, but I just need to know that she's all right. She must have passed through Mother's crown. My aunt Salai lives there. They might have spoken. Maybe she can tell you more. All right. All mother, hear my prayer. We run everywhere like warriors. Okay, now. So she survived after all. I just keep gossiping, guys. I'm right here. Thanks, dude. Tough, yeah, see, notice that exclamation point. This must be where the war party got massacred. Such destruction. We'll deal with him in just a second. For now, plot. I don't know. Look at all those machines, and look at how many those times machines. they missed! All controlled by the killers. Maybe the war chief left something behind. The Nora managed to take down a corruptor. But not before the killers used it to send the other machines against them. They sent a stampede of them down the slope. Let us speak! The dead and wounded all cleared away. Are there no more braves or healers here? Just me. You're hurt. What happened? Well, I didn't. It's madness out there. War Chief Sona sent me back to report. I'm no good to her like this. Varl told me that the War Chief tracked the killers. Did she find them? We followed their trail, but again and again they sent corrupted machines to attack us. His face paint is interesting. My Everybody else's up until now has been blue. His is white. So the war chief sent me back to let others know she hasn't given up the fight. So, you were here when the war party was ambushed? I was. I thought after the proving there could be no darker day, but I was wrong. The war chief was delayed gathering the rear guard. Eager for revenge, the braves in the lead fell into the trap. Dozens lost in minutes. If Sona hadn't arrived and rallied us, no one would have survived. Varl sent me to look for Sona. Do you know where she is now? All I can tell you is where we parted. Near the metal tower, southeast of the ruins of Devil's Thirst. Look to the rise behind it with a lone boulder. I'll head for the embrace and report what I know to Varl and the others. May all mother lend you strength. You'll need it, going alone. And this is further along the road than we were before, so... And now... 
notice. That is Nils with three new bodies for us. He really wants to be friends. Those are friendship corpses, as the title said. Yeah, and because useful. there's no point in delaying this further and I can just put this back with the other side quests, we'll talk to him now. There's danger ahead, girl. Danger for you, Outlander. This is Norland. Yes, yes, yes. Trespass is forbidden on pain of death. Strange phrase, the pain of death. See? This one's in no pain at all. Who was he? A thief. Slaver, a killer. The kind that give honest killers a bad name. Farrell told me there would be bandit ambushes on the road. Well, it's not all good news. They don't always come to you. Most dig out a camp, and there they'll sit like spoil on meat. Unless someone does something about it? I like you. Follow the trail of smoke on the other side of the ruins. I'll be there. He is the weirdest little thing, but we will we will explore him at greater length later. For now, though, let's, uh, since it is the easiest of them so far, let's go ahead and try out these, uh, these first hunting grounds. Bioterrorist and Doom Cult member Harriet Choi. Oh, I got something good from it, too. Nice. It's telling me to go that way, but the hunting grounds are literally, like, right up here. Aren't they? Did I miss them? Sorry, dude. I'll shake it out later. Is there a way to climb up from there? Doesn't look like it. There would be handholds. Oh, hi, dude. Sorry for running right over you. I appreciate that, like, you don't bump and jostle and knock people over like you do in, like, in things like Tomb Raider or Assassin's Creed or what have you. It's... I'm gonna fall right down that pit if I'm not careful. Brave trail. Should be a cache of dream wheel up there. All oh, right, that also. I have completely fudged the layout of this area in my head. I can't override this machine yet. I need to find a way to learn. I am the Scarlet Underbrush. Pay no attention to me. Quiet does it. 
Let's get rid of some of the excess, especially since it looks like I was right about to run out of room. Really don't need that right now. Let's see how we doing. Well, clearly something I need to do. I keep hitting pause because I keep forgetting. Max that puppy out. <laughs> Not the button I wanted. There we go. This is a hunting grounds, right? What do you do here, exactly? Hmm. You bear the mark of a seeker. I've heard of those, but never seen one. You have the matriarch's leave to come and go as you like from the sacred land? Yes, but I would have gone even without their permission. Is that so? Then maybe you and I can speak plainly. Truth is, I've had dealings with the Karja. I represent an organization called the Hunter's Lodge in Meridian. We test promising young hunters with trials at places like these. You might be just the kind of person we're looking for. Why don't you sample the trials and see? Just to be clear, though, I'd appreciate it if you kept our conversation in confidence, especially when it comes to the matriarchs. Tell me about the trials. The Hunter's Lodge hosts hunting ground trials throughout the world. Each offering hunters a chance to test their skills. What do I get for completing them? Pride and accomplishment, as well as marks, depending on how well you fare. Here, we offer the tools trials. What kind of tools? Hunting isn't just about your bow. It's about using everything available to you, even your surroundings. You'll see once you start taking the trials. These serve a good purpose in just pick. making you Which familiarize yourself you? with this you different the stuff. Parts alone, log pile, blast. I actually need to I get to these other I'll things first. Keep forgetting, you actually have to own some of this stuff. Like, I don't have a sling. We will find better ones. Yeah, rule of thumb when I do these. If I have something that's better than a green in any of these, then I sell the green ones. Always. Don't really need the tutorial right now. Looking forward to another run, are you? Or my first run, anyway. Test your skill with bow and arrow by shooting parts off the backs of grazers as quickly as possible. That's a good one. Timing begins once you slide down a rope. Now, for this one, I already know that the regular bow will take the parts off of them easy, and it draws faster, so... That's got their attention. Damn it.
Really? This one's after it. Oh, that was almost cool. And I am out of dudes. <clears throat> Did not do well in any way, shape, or form on that. Next time around, I just need to be more precise. <clears throat> we want to get a son, at least, and then I'll leave. You didn't succeed, but I've done that. Test your skill. I like that one. I don't like that they repopulate quickly. That's nice, at least. Wherever these. Are. Damn. Cannot see their canisters from here, doesn't count. That is one of the downsides that they give you to story mode, is a lot of the things that you need to do for challenges, especially with this equipment, is a little bit more challenging in its own way. Specifically because if you are not extremely precise, you will do too much damage and kill, uh, kill a machine before you're supposed to. 
You didn't. Test your. Perfect. I love when she just randomly looks like she's about to totally miss a jump that anybody could get. in that direction quick, didn't they? Damn it. Or... Really? 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 Five. Six. Seven. I'm trying to figure out how I'm already one short. Is there just one that didn't run down here? Is that what it is? Yes, according to this, that's exactly what happened. Or not. Where are you at? There are you at. More than a quick to take there you we on. go. Well... That wasn't the best, but I got it. Let's go collect my bronze medal. <laughs> you praise me. You passed. I bet you'll be wanting your half-son now. I should go. Come back when you... We'll come back here and phone up on that at another point in time, because that was... that was dismal. And look at all these parts I have left over. Look at all this blaze. I can't wait until I actually start using this for stuff. Oh, it's you again. It's where we found Nils the first time. But now... He decided to come back over here to let us know. And he gave us new bodies. Just to entice the focus us. This is picking up some kind of signal. Maybe I can scan it. That signal. Where is it coming from? And up here is where we encounter one of my favorite machines in the game. The robot giraffes.
Because if you could build a robot, why wouldn't you build a robot giraffe? I ask you. These will keep. Born. What do we got? Another fox. I also love the ruins of... Is it Colorado Springs? I think this is? Is not where I wanted to be. Gotcha. The must be coming from Tolnik's head. I need to find a way to climb it. Just have to reach its head. I'm used to having to wait for those things to come around for a while. They're enormous and majestic, and I love them. And I don't really have to fight with them, I just have to be good at climbing. go. An entire refugee museum. And if I'm not mistaken, there is something up here, so... A thing. Not much else by the looks of it, but... Would have been an interesting spot to have a, a lookout point, but we can't always have nice things. This must be the rise Sona's runner told me about. Dressings for moons. They must have taken a moment to rest. Arrow shards. That old bow has seen a lot of the war chief stopped here. No one would have left it willingly. Soon has taken losses. Couldn't have been easy going on after the ambush. The runner wasn't the only one who got hurt. Braves were crafting ammunition here. I wonder if anybody's done a playthrough where instead of using the, uh, the focus tracks. tracks, trying to follow the actual physical tracks that are there. Looks like Sona and her graves headed for that ridge. It's 
it's probably not easy to do, come to think of it. But I think it would also be like, it is not lore friendly because Aloy very clearly <clears throat> relies on her focus. And, oh, I want to go fight with those, but plot. <clears throat> And I would, but it would be such a pain in the ass to get back up here again. A dead sawtooth. Maybe Sona took it out. She could be close. Hell steel, not cool. You're lucky I happened by. One heartbeat more, and that sawtooth would have torn you apart. Half a heartbeat more, and I would have killed it myself. Uh, so you're War Chief Sona? Varl asked me to find you. Has he held the gate? He has. Bravely. I saw him kill a corrupted machine himself. But he worries for you. Our tribe needs strength, not sentiment. I've tracked some of the killers who struck the Proving. I crave vengeance. Do you? That's not sentiment? You have no idea. Show me then. Lend me your strength. Follow. I like the very clear resemblance between her and Varl, too. That makes me very happy. The killers are just across this ridge, digging the cursed earth. Well? The sin of the ancients is buried in that soil. Corrupt demons. I know of them. I killed one at Mother's Watch. A bold claim. I wonder if you'll live up to it. Let's... When we get to this, we get to see how badly I can screw up a stealth mission. and braves into hiding in the trees below. On my signal, they'll attack. The enemy and their demonic machines outnumber us, but we will have fury on our side. We could have more than that. Explain. That's Blaze. What we used to burn, they used to blast. That's how they dug out this pit. So we put fire to it and then? Boom. Then let us begin. Whoa, wait. Let's not rush. Give me some time to make an approach. If I end up alerting them, open fire. All right. Let's see what you can do. Well, I, I hope it's something, because... Man, I've not been having a good day today. First of all... I do love a long dodge roll. I'll do that. I do not have the stealth weave thing yet, but I can add at least a little stealth to this. Switch to this. Darkness will help. Of 
crap, that wasn't what I wanted. Come here, ugly. Get you out of the way now while you're in range. Well, I'm glad that for whatever reason he didn't see me because the eye was wide open just then. Tiny bit of cover. Not when he's looking right at me. To me, let's take her Here down. Damn it. Well, that tells you right there. I did not do a good job. Well, that makes you unobservant and terrible. This wasn't all the killers. I counted more at the War Party Massacre. If I have to chase their filthy shadows from here to Spears Reach, I will. You're hurt. Losing blood. My health is not your concern. No one doubts your determination, but you need rest. She's right, War Chief. Give your wounds time to close. Val! What are you doing here? I ordered you to hold that gate with your life. And so I did, until the runner you sent returned with news of his encounter with Aloy and your location. I left the gate well guarded. My place is here, with you, with our vengeance. Am I not owed that? Uh, maybe I should have a look around, see if I can figure out where the rest of the killers are. Do as you wish. Everyone else does. Mother. She is the angriest mom. Further back in the ruins than I thought I was. Commanders, over the past month, accidental blaze explosions have killed a dozen men. Here in the Ring of Metal, I've taken the precaution of placing our entire stockpile in a covered shelter, safe from stray sparks and lightning, and I've posted guards to control access. I urge you to take similar measures, or suffer the consequences. 
Supply Master Thrawn, out. <sighs> A blaze stockpile inside their base. Sabotage that, and we win. I found something. The rest of the killers are camped inside a ring of metal. Any idea what that means? Damn them. The ring of metal lies in the ruins of Devil's Grief. That grand is taboo. I will return to the Matriarchs, beg them to make an exception. There's no time for that. Blood spilled calls for blood spilled. If the ground is cursed, then let our vengeance sanctify it. You blaspheme. Please, War Chief, break the taboo. Devil's Grief is a cursed place. But maybe Aloy's secret blessing can protect us. I'll send scouts ahead. Our force will assemble at the cliff above Red Echoes and launch our attack from there. Sounds like a plan. See you there. Alrighty, there should be something I can grab onto here, but there isn't, because life isn't fair. <clears throat> and it looks like we can go and deal with our buddy Nils before we get out there, so there's that at least. Let's go select that on the... I keep calling him Nils. That's that's a character from Psychonauts. That's not him. Since you're right there. Nutritious. Tastes just like bacon. If I remember correctly, there is a viewpoint around here somewhere. And lucky me, I might be able to see it in the dark. Now I have absolutely accidentally just gone in and done this sucker without even talking to him. And that kind of makes it awkward, because he still has the same conversation with you like you didn't just go in and kill everybody. So, there it is. Advantage. I wonder what it will show. The Paca shit storm tour. Day three. I was 13. I broke in and vandalized this place. Me and that kid, I think his name was Star. It was my first arrest. A real banner day for the Mahdi family. What a messed up kid I was. Well. You really can't see what it used to be. And you wouldn't have imagined if you, uh, hadn't seen that. That's what I like about a lot of the designs in this. Neat. That'll keep my stomach quiet. <clears throat> Goro spoke of a bandit camp in some metal ruins. That must be the place there. Best keep an eye out around here. I'm glad you came. You're glad? Why? Call it a shared interest. And call me Nil. Look there, those old rocks. A bandit clan squats under them. Disturb the rocks and they'll come wriggling out. Worms that they are. Bandits. Why have they come here? The Nora are in trouble. And rumors spread like blood. With no braves to guard the border, killers hungry for sport slip right through. My partner and I shadowed these scum for days. Good tracker, but he went on ahead without me. We talked about this kind of behavior. Still, I understand. Leave it too long, your fingers itch for the bowstring. Say, how about you and I work together? Kill them all. 
I don't know you, and I have no reason to trust you. Trust is a rare egg to find, isn't it? I'm just a traveler, with a bow, concern about the state of these lands, and a missing partner. I don't think you're just anything at all. Hmm. Let me put it another way. Are you a bandit? <sighs> of course not. Then you have nothing to fear from. I don't I'm need your help to clear out some bandits. A loner. That's exciting. Don't worry. If they kill you, I'll finish them off before they can make a cup of your skull and another nonsense like that. Well, that's comforting. That's the alarm. Let them sound it and more will come running. It's a gift. And if you're the heroic kind who needs a little extra, there's the captives. I need to keep my kit dry. Well, that's not happening today, sweetheart. And then I go back over here because they will see me coming over that bridge. And I'm going to try to do this quietly. Okie dokie. One, two, three, four, five. No way in hell there's just eight of them. Definitely hit that spear on the way. Haven't you got anything better to do? Man down. A corpse. New one's good. Oh. Missing any other ones? Not yet. Or I'm not close enough to see anyway. to it. Okay, alarm's down. We got a stiff over here. Okay. That torch is ruining everything right now. They saw me. This is it. What the hell it is?
shotgun look like it? Frost always said, patience. Okay, they're way over on the other side. They're not coming down this way. Okay. That's red grass over there. Can I see you from here? Come on. Yes! They're not just cutthroats. Slavers, too. I'll get this open. Hold on. Are you ready to move? Oh. Hi, fella. Just those two left, it looks like? Fabulous. Successful ish stealth mission. Huzzah! Seeker, may I speak with you? I'm honored. I. All mother be praised. Are you alright? Is there something you need? Yes. My friends and I watched you clear the bandits out of this camp. We're glad. They would steal from us, chase us through the night laughing. We're outcasts, not braves. Almost defenseless. Where did you all come from? Some of us have wandered the sacred lands for years. As for me, the village I grew up in was burned in the Red Raids. I'm ashamed I wasn't there to protect them. But I was an outcast long before the Karja came. How did you all come to be here together? You wonder how we speak to each other when the law forbids it. But what hope do we have here, outside the embrace, alone? I wasn't judging you. I was an outcast once. Forgive me. You're right to ask. I convinced them to speak. I told them we were only sentenced to be outcast. Not to die out here. An intelligent approach. How did you come to be an outcast? I was a fool. I refused to do what I was told. Never went hunting when I could sit under a tree instead. I argued with my family every step, picked fights with other braves. One day, such a fight grew fierce. I got a lucky hit, an unlucky one. He went down and there was no one left to speak for me. I deserve to be an outcast. You seem different from the person you describe. I hope to be. We are all outcasts, but we need to stay together to survive. This camp we once hated could serve us well now. Would you let us stay here? Even if it flies in the face of the Matriarch's laws? It's not like the Matriarchs course, are gonna come out and check. Means. Oh. I'd hoped you'd say so. You... you're an inspiration to us. Thank you. 
That's... Somebody remarked in a previous discussion that it's admirable for the writing, at the very least, that there's no one group in this who has all of the answers. Like, everybody's got, like, some messed up ideas going on with them, and the Nora have this thing where they kick people out and they're just flat out not allowed to talk to each other when they're made outcast. What they basically say when they kick you out is you're not allowed to have community of any kind, and that's kind of messed up. But also kind of a large-scale thing that you see with families when a parent disowns a child. So I see where it comes from, but... Man, that's a hard thing to support when you have an outside perspective on it. So I like that Aloy at least gets to make things a little fast. better while she's here. I still like the idea of a story where Boston Vala made it and came along with her, especially since, in a lot of ways, Aloy already seems like she's pretty much done with the Nora. Once she's out of here, there's no reason for her to come back and stay, or to live like a Nora. So having people with her who would take the things that they learned back with them and make the Nora better would be an interesting story to hear. Who knows, maybe I'll write a fanfic. Like I've said before, one of the things I try to do when I have money is push my wire up to at least 200. Do we have the stuff for anything cool right now? That, at least. And it's better stealth than what I have right now. I'm gonna go ahead and get that. Uh, nothing in heavy right now. Neither the shards nor the stuff. We're getting some bellow back hearts. Dang it. But first, let's go and talk to Nell about how much happier I am doing these, these bandit missions without him tagging along. Because he always gets in the way. I called him Nils again, didn't I? I'll admit, at first I felt slighted by your selfishness, but you know, I'm glad I stayed to watch. Every kill you made, I prick my fingers on an arrowhead just to, to feel part of things. You were keeping score? What's wrong with you? You were self-harming to keep you. score? I didn't find your partner. They killed him. I hardly feel surprised. He was already getting cocky when we carved through the last bandit camp. I thought him and I were agreed. Only enjoy the killing as much as the challenge. No great loss. Nothing in the wilds I can't handle, just me and the voice of our teeth here. Your bow has a name? Yours doesn't. You're not just a traveler. That armor was fitted for you, and the way you hold your bow. I said a concerned traveler. I was a soldier, but I was a soldier longer than there was a war, if you follow. Where the arrowhead passes between armor and skin, that's the place I belong. So I make opportunities to find it. It's like coming home. Have you ever thought about hunting machines? No, uh, they don't get that look in their eyes. Did bandits wrong you somehow? They wrong us all. They live filthy lives, so they have to die that way too. So you hunt them down to help others? No, no. For sport. I can't wait for wars anymore. Life's too short and the thrill of death too sharp. If you kill a tribesman, there'll be retribution. Hunt a boar, they complain if you waste the meat. But bandits, 
they're vicious. They always put up a fight, and no one cares if you kill them. I guess you're doing the right thing for the wrong reason. I'm doing what I love. And what could be wrong with that? Well. We're done here. Here? I'm afraid so. But we live in a world of ruins, and bandits are drawn to them like infection to a wound. You wouldn't want that infection set in, would you? I'm sure we'll meet again. Maybe. If it can't be helped. If we pass each other by, we'll know it by hope. So you want to hunt some shadow carja with me? Maybe? Huh? Also, look, his headdress confuses me. Are those feathers in the back? Are they strips of leather? What? And if they are feathers, where did he find a bird with plumage like that? These are the questions I find myself asking. Okie dokie. You could have just told me you were going to take me right through there. Oh well, that's that. If I'm not mistaken, there are bellowbacks through here. At some point. Which is good, because I need bellowback hearts. See, I'm not losing my mind, am I? It used to be I could one-shot them right in the canister. Is that an effect of the derangement? Or... Or what, son? Guess I'll wash away the scent for now. I still need another raccoon. All right, what do we got? Turkeys, foxes. sad about is this rain is killing my visibility.
Oh, I got a lens. That's not a heart, though. There's another one around here somewhere. I just gotta find it. Unless somebody else killed it. That'd suck. Where are you at? Come on. There you at. But no, it's a shell walker. That's not what I'm looking for either. I can take one of those two, though. Grass. Okay, here we go. Now another thing that is a touch troublesome. Is you can knock one of these canisters off, but they will go out of their way to pick it back up. Is that everybody? Are we good? Awesome. Cool. Let's see what we got. Oh. Nothing good in the canister. How boring. That corruption zone, that's going to be another fun one, but one we can do from the air. And that'll get me in front of another bellow back, so... <laughs> the key is to run up here far enough that none of the dudes down there can really figure out what the hell you're doing or where you're at. You guys drop some nice stuff. Damn. I'm gonna have to wait for that one to give up looking for me. Because they hide. Yes! Nice. Target nice. Please let that one armor ask for a charger heart and not a charger lens. That is the only thing I want. And another lookout point is Nya. Just as soon as I hit that. Every vantage a story. Am I not in the right spot? There we go. Apocalypse Storm Tour, day five. Well, I've missed day four and day Brace one somewhere. Open for turtle smash the night I OD'd here. Or so the police report said, anyway. I was 15 years old. When I woke in the hospital, two days later, 
Your face was the first thing I saw. That's the first relatively nice thing he said. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, there's some trouble this way. Keep that for later. Keep rolling down the hill, buddy. It's fine. There's that trouble I was talking about. I think I can get him, though. in higher difficulty settings there are two of those around and a couple watchers if I'm not mistaken probably whatever the hell that is over there time for some more stealth I think Devil's grief. Foreboding sight, huh? Don't you ever wonder what it used to look like? Back when the old ones lived here. You're not like other Nora. That's what they tell me. War Chief. Our scouts found enemy camps in the ruins, guarding the approach to the Ring of Metal. Then we should hit those camps first. Make sure they stay quiet. Agreed. Wipe out the camps, and our enemies in the Ring of Metal won't see us coming. I'll take out the alarms. We'll send braves to each camp to lie in wait. Would you start? They'll help finish. Considering I will probably fuck this up, that's a good thing. I need to get him in the brush because that guy is looking right at me. Nobody's looking at you, fella, so...
Really? Heaven's sake, they're still looking. We got us a corpse over here. Man down. It's a machine. They crap out all the time. Blue screen of death. It's nothing. Great. A new plan. I'm a little mad that worked. Okay, got him, got him. I think I can see, and no, I can't. Nothing that's going to take me straight up there, so... Experience tells me there's really not that much of a difference in terms of distance Ouch. between those two places, so... Let's sally forth. A thingy thing. Strike from above. Balanced aim is one I haven't been I haven't gotten yet that I could really use because I keep trying to use it. their sentries. Nice. All right. Deux, trois, quatre, Do, 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 I'm not here.
This fog is killing me. Really? Quietly. Thank you everyone for not caring what he had to say. You made this mission possible. not even gonna happen because of the damn border. Let's see. Really? Well, I'm glad he didn't hear it. the alarm anyway. I want you all to know you were very helpful by not jumping in that one time I thought I was caught. a weird thing to want. Lines up just very nicely. Hello, friend. I have a clear shot at your head, buddy. Damn. I still have it highlighted. 
for the secret lands. We got any dudes left? There we go. On the attack. Dick. I'll take you down. You have spears. There, finally. For the generations before me. I'll take it. Is that the tallest tower? Turkey Fox. Oh, that's the tallest tower. Turkey, 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 Nora. Turkey. Now, before I fool with any of your stuff, I've got a tower to climb. Which may be a bit of a pain in the ass to do in the dark, because I'm not going to be able to see colors as well. I love that the deterioration is so great in these buildings that in some places it is hard to tell what part is the natural stuff that grew in later and what used to be, like, you know part of the architecture which like it's been what like 2,000 years so think finishing this revenge mission will be a nice way to cap off to cap off tonight's broadcast. What do you guys think? Don't actually have to answer. Is that just the moon doing all that? Apparently went out the other end. Good job, me. There Save we go. this for later. The camps have been dealt with. Now to the Ring of Metal. Its high walls protect the enemy. We'll have to scale the height. Under fire if we're detected. I have another idea. Their base has a weakness. Send me in alone, and I'll exploit it. If I'm successful... I'll blow a hole in those walls big enough for the entire war party to charge through. Sounds like a plan. So long as I get to come with you. A war chief should be grateful for two arrows so eager to spring from the bow. Yes, Varl. Go with Aloy as her spearmate, but be vigilant. Yes, war chief. I will. Go now. We wait on your signal.
All right. Let's go screw this up, Varl. You do have a plan, right? You followed me this far, even into the ruins. I thought you trusted me. I do, but how would you know that this base has a weakness? Patience, Varl. You'll know soon enough. I think we just found a loading screen, you guys. Take my hand. Do, 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 do. Putting on the Ritz. Take that was not the line. correct music. Oh, I don't have strike from above yet. Do I have enough for strike from above? I do. One of us died <gasps> Varl, you had a job. That's better. Teamwork. Coordination. There. See that covered shelter? Do you see those corruptors? No, Focus, actually. That shelter is full of blaze. A whole stockpile of it. If I set it off, the explosion will destroy those corruptors and collapse the wall, too. A breach for the Nora to charge through. Can't hit it from here, though. We'll need to get closer. I'll get closer. You head back, tell Sona the plan, and lead them to that side of the ring. I'll see it done. And when the wall collapses, I'll be first through the breach. Now all I have to do is make it all happen. Well, first things first, because I've always screwed this up. I'll make sure I have I these equipped quietly. from the start. There, he says. I am not here. You cannot see me. I just need to get an angle on that blaze and shoot it. I should be able to hit the blaze from here. I wonder if anybody's ever played through this and tried to, like, take out everybody before blowing the wall open. Still managed to kill somebody. I'm impressed at me. Ah, crap. Crap. 
damn it. Mother, look upon our victory. A debt of blood is paid. Remember this day, brave Nora. From your lips to the goddess's ears. Yes, remember it. Be ready to leave this place. Let your spears and arrows rest in the bodies of the fallen. They are tainted. Like these ruins. And watch me just loot a bunch of bodies after she says that. It's over. I guess none of you are going to use these tainted metal shards then. It's the cool. Killers, this corruption, they're all parts of the mystery I'm chasing. Where the trail leads, I go. You won't be coming back with us, will you? I don't think so. I'm glad you accomplished what you were looking for, Varl, but I haven't. Not yet. Look, I know you have to go. You're a seeker, after all. But if you ever pass this way again... Then what? It'd be good to see you, that's all. I expect we'll regroup at Mother's Crown. Maybe I'll see you there? Maybe you will. I'll see you then. Aww. Actually, that's a good, uh, that's a good milestone point. Since the next thing I'm going to do is go back and tell Rost about it. And that'll be a good way to cap off tonight's broadcast. Though in future ones, it might be how I begin broadcasts, too. Then she's technically recapping what we did last time. But then I wouldn't get to have fun telling everybody about it. Let's see. Right here. For me here anymore. Hi, Rost. Not much has happened since my last visit. The killers from the Proving. They aren't going to hurt anyone anymore. I tracked them to Devil's Grief. There was a battle. And we won. Varl, he... made an impression. Has some other issues, but... I like him. Well, I... I guess I should be going. And with that short visit, we're coming on the two-hour mark. I want to thank you all for joining me tonight. And as always, my regular transmissions for story-driven games like this are Mondays and Wednesdays at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard U.S. time. So Wednesday, we will pick this up. My in-between days, lately I've been doing Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2, but we might move on to something new now, now that I know that Funimation, or not Funimation, uh, Bandai is, is blocking a bunch of important scenes. 
but we'll see and I will hang with you guys then. If you're watching on YouTube, please remember to like and subscribe and come on over to Twitch and watch us live sometime. If you're watching on PS4, you can find me on Twitch and on YouTube under the name Impure Tale, as opposed to, I think this one is You Made It Weird. So, yes, this has been fun. Thank you all for joining me tonight and I will see you all later.